Howdy folks, and Merry Christmas. Welcome to the latest version of my 3D printed high performance RC hovercraft, the Hovernaut. Instead of using the traditional bolting mechanism when clamping the skirt down, this one uses something more akin to a window screen. There's a piece of PVC tubing that sits in a clamping mechanism that is basically a circle that's three quarters of a circle, and then the skirt goes in and out the edges of the circle, and the tubing inside uh, firmly secures that into place. Uh, as far as the rest of the hovercraft goes, the body is pretty much the same as the second generation. I've started printing parts like motor struts. Anything that's reprinted is now printed in like a final 3D print finish. Previously, everything was hastily printed um, just to save time, but now that we're coming down on what the design should be, um, we're starting to final print any parts that we do. I also ended up moving the motors a little bit. I placed them on nylon standoffs because the heat being transferred from the motor mount into the motor strut was actually warping the plastic. And here's a closer look at the skirt clamping mechanism. You can see the tubing inside there, the vinyl tubing, and uh, that just pushes in there. It's nice and flexible and works out pretty good. And I put different motors on this. I had 1300 kV motors before that was way too high. So these are uh, Hextronic motors. I believe these are 750 kV and uh, might get new ones soon. Um, but yeah, here's a look at the electronics box inside. You can see that nothing has really changed. We're still using an Arduino Omega in the back. I actually don't like that. It resets when I crash into things. So I think we're going to switch that for a PIC microcontroller here in the near future. And I also need new batteries. i got new batteries coming in the next couple of days. You can see that one has split its case, and the other one split its case a long time ago. So let's take a look at the initial test runs from this version's build. I hope you all enjoy, and catch you next time.